Hey everyone, welcome to Back to the Arcade. It's a uh, game room that I finally finished in my basement. Con I uh, converted a completely unfinished basement to what I thought was a pretty cool game room. Standing at the top of the stairs here, and this is called Shockwave Carpet. It's actually a uh, blacklight carpet that's used in uh, commercial settings and game rooms. So right now we're going to walk down the stairs with the regular lights on, no black lights. Got my hoverboard there, my flux capacitor. And here's the game room. Got a Back to the Future pinball machine. Of course, the NBA Jam. I've actually fixed a lot of these games up myself. I bought this one with a busted monitor. So I learned a little monitor work on this one. Got a uh, rare Michael Jackson's Moonwalker here. It's in excellent shape. It actually has the original topper, but since the uh, ceiling's a little bit low in here, I can't put it on. I'll most likely be hanging it on the wall somewhere. Has all the side art intact. Original control panel. Pack land. I actually bought this one. It was completely covered in black paint. It was really rough. Didn't have the right marquee. Control panel was all beat up. So I actually stripped the entire cabinet of all the black paint. And guess what was underneath? The original side art, which you really can't see right there, but it's back there. Got a tapper that's out of commission over here, Budweiser tapper. That might actually get worked on today. That'll be probably one of my next restoration projects. Got a Legend of Zelda blanket here. Kind of doubles as a room divider. And a super rare haunted castle. If you guys know what Castlevania was when you were a kid, or when you were younger, depending on how old you are, this was the first Castlevania game released in the arcade. Got a Tekken 2 here that will be converted into a MAME cabinet at some point. It's kind of uh, in progress here. The monitor's not hooked up and the control panel's not finished yet. This Pac-Man I actually uh, built myself. I found an old Pac-Man cabinet that was totally beat. Put brand new graphics on it. Cleaned it all up. Brand new control panel, new monitor. Put a multi-cade in it, 60 in one. As Miss Pac-Man with the speed up chip. So far I'm enjoying the heck out of this place. Thought it came out real well. I still have a few things to do. Um, tie up some loose ends. And like the stereo wire, I gotta hide some of that. Let me hang a couple more things. Got my custom made DeLorean sign. It's actually uh, carved out of wood and painted by an artist. And uh, another room divider here. Some Mega Man. Got my uh, barrel cooler and my IKEA stool. And this carpet's really neat really impressed with it. So what I did was I actually put a bunch of black lights down here, which I'll show you right now. And it glows really nicely. So I kind of hit a few underneath the ceiling here. Close the carpet and your socks, really nice. And the carpet just comes alive. It's really cool. I'm not sure if you can see it too well with the camera here, but the color actually changes from the green that you saw earlier to more of a blue. There, that's, that's kind of what it looks like there. It's really neat. 
Very happy with it. So for a small game room, I packed in as many uh, arcade and pinball machines as I possibly could. And here we are. <laughs>